This is a story about me and my Georgie. From Lancashire we are, 21 and 28, and this is why we want an alligator. As dealing with sheep we love, it's not something we hate. I'm a herds person on a robotic dairy farm, trimming cow's feet and AIing them too. But I know what I'd rather do. Be running around the field with my lovely boyfriend, trying to gather sheep with no dog or a bag, most often very late into a cold, dark night. Whilst George is in with the cows, I'm on the side, building, welding, draining, or concreting our mites. We both have to work to help us get by, but working together with our sheep is really what gives us a high. We take pride in our flock of 170 ewes, especially our pedigree, Texel Blues. We have a lot of fields, but not a lot of land, which is a nightmare, sheep folk, you must understand. We don't have a farm, not even a yard. This is why our lives are so, so hard. So we traipse our hurdles from one field to another. The chance of an alligator, oh, it makes me shudder. Our weight scales were my granddad's. They are old as both of us put together. But if we had some new ones, well, they wouldn't <laughs> rust in this lovely Lancashire weather. The chance of an electric scanner would make George's dreams come true. As she does all the paperwork and writing down too. She deserves an agrident stick reader instead of all that writing. With that piece of quick kit, would make it as quick as lightning. Some have called us stupid, silly, or even mad, but our own farm and business is something that we've never had. But with help of an alligator, we could be on the road to have our own farm for our animals, a place to call our home. So for everyone with a farm, a quad, a sheepdog, a holding pen, spare a thought for S&G, the midnight shepherds from Lancashire, who don't have any of this, just each other, and a strong, strong desire.